going to do a and a I put out on my social media channels that I wanted you guys to put forward some questions that I could answer. I got an overwhelming amount, so I have sifted through them, and hopefully I should be able to touch almost every subject. So, off we go. What are your top three tips for a first time bikini prepper? Okay, so number one, know why you're doing it. Number two, practice your posing from day one. And number three, surround yourself with people who are going to understand why you're doing it, what you're doing, and who are going to really push you through the, the harder days. Um, what's your advice for getting a coach? Okay, so um, look at their past success, look at their past client transformation, um, have a conversation with them, make sure that you know that you're going to get on with them, and then speak to their past or present clients. If you ever wanted to give up, how did you get back on track? So all I used to think was, if I do everything my coach tells me to do and I give every workout my all, um, then I will get on that stage and whatever the outcome is, I'll feel proud. If I'm not to do that and I end up doing shit, then it was my own fault. So that's what kept me motivated and kept me staying on track. How did you deal with post-comp weight gain? So I actually gained about like five kilos pretty fast. To be honest, I didn't even notice. Um, I was really enjoying my life. I was enjoying going out and stuff like that. And towards the end of my prep, I was hating being shredded. All I wanted was to fill out my clothes, um, to have fun and to stop feeling so isolated. Would you do another comp? Um, for the moment, no, I would do you count calories and macros and if so what is your split? So no I don't count calories and macros, I generally know what works for my body and so I eat to fuel my body. When do you eat most carbs and what's your pre and post workout meal of choice? So I will eat carbs pre workout and post workout, I eat carbs in my um, like my evening meal. Um, pre workout choice would be oats, so overnight oats, oats, oats any form of oats and um, post workout I'll stick to a protein and a carbohydrate so rice or sweet potato or something like that what's your training split okay so on a Monday I will train back and biceps Tuesday is leg day posterior Wednesday I will do cardio so lifts that will be on a stairmaster or a treadmill and then I'll finish that off with hit um, Thursday chest and triceps Friday legs again but all over legs and Saturday um, I do strongman with a pro fit guys. Do you take rest days? So yeah I, do, I take a rest day on a Sunday and if I'm busy or I'm really not feeling like training then I won't train, it's no stress. What's your fave exercise? So I love training glutes and I think my fave exercise currently is a banded goblet squat. What was the thing that clicked for you two years ago to regain your health back? Okay, so I guess I just, I, I was starting to see how it was affecting my parents and the people around me and I just hit a point where I just thought like this isn't a life and I will either recover or I will die and I didn't want to die so I decided to, to fight against it and recover. What goal are you most proud of? I'm most proud of recovering from an eating disorder, it's very challenging. Um, but in doing that, I've been able to, to reach out to a lot of people and I've been able to inspire other people to believe that they can do it too. And what's the biggest thing you want to achieve this year? Okay, so by the end of this year, I would love to have held a seminar um, in a different country, um, talking all things self-love, self-worth, personal development. Chocolate or peanut butter? Peanut butter. Last but not least, my favourite, what's your favourite biscuits? Crunch cream. So that's the end of my Q&A. Thank you so much if you asked some questions. I'm sorry if I didn't get to answer your questions, but hopefully I did cover um, everything that you wanted to know. Um, if you enjoyed this video, then please give it a like. If you could, please subscribe to the channel. And if you've got any comments, anything else that you want to ask, then do leave something in the comments below. Thanks guys.